Last week, I invited you to try to find echoes of your own self in the Pharisee that appears in this parable. If you, like me, were able to do that, were able to see the way that you set yourself off against others and look down on them, that is, break the unity within God's people by your own uh, contempt, then maybe now you are ready to see yourself also in the second character, the tax collector, the one who recognizes that he has fallen short. And so we're going to work on just the, the middle section of the parable. And uh, I suggest you pay attention to it. Pay attention to some of the interesting differences. For example, the Pharisee is off standing by himself in our translation, suggesting he self-isolates. Uh, the tax collector perhaps also is self-isolating, but he is standing far off as though he has no right to enter into the assembly, both um, causing a chasm, uh, but from different perspectives. So let's listen to the attitudes of, of these two people. And again, I'm trying to remember to not portray the, way, the Pharisee in such a way that I don't see myself in him. Two men went to the temple to pray. One was a Pharisee and the other a tax collector. The Pharisee, standing off by himself, was praying thus. God, I thank you that I'm, I'm not like other people. I, I'm not a thief, a rogue, an adulterer, or, or even like this tax collector. I fast twice a week, and, and give one-tenth of all that I have. But the tax collector, standing far off, would not even look up to heaven. He was beating his breast and saying, God, be merciful to me. So we're going to stop there. It's a, a, a good portion, nice size portion to, to absorb during this week. Again, just keep looking for yourself in both characters, identifying with them to the extent that you're able. And maybe you'll hear a word from God from both those aspects of yourself. Next week, uh, we'll look at the conclusion, and then we'll finish up the following week with the introduction. I hope your storytelling practice continues to go well. I find visiting the, the passage day after day is a great way to absorb it, not to try to get it all in one gulp. Thank you.